Okay, and so we begin by taking in three deep breaths in through the nose. Hold out through the mouth, nice and loud. In through the nose. Out through the mouth, all the stress of the day. And breathe in through the nose. And breathe out what no longer serves us. And see the divine spark in the centre of your heart. Extend it up through the top of your head, through the stars, all the way up to the highest dimension you can imagine. And they are connecting to the highest dimension of source. Remain connected into source and extend your light cord down through the stars, the sky, back down to the top of your head and into your heart. And extend the light cord from the centre of your heart down through the roots of your spine, all the way down through the layers of the planet until you reach the very core of Mother Earth. And there, connect in your light cord into Mother Gaia's crystalline heart. Remain connected into Gaia's heart and extend your light cord back up through the roots of your spine and into your heart. And now around each of us individually we create a golden bubble, a protective bubble of light, setting the intention that only energies and entities with our permission, highest good love and compassion, can see us or access us or exist within our bubbles. And now, into our golden bubbles, we invite in every aspect of us, our higher selves, our angels, Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, our guides. And through space and time, we create a golden bubble around everyone with the highest good love and compassion who has chosen to enter this live stream or this replay to participate in this session. Setting the intention that only energies and entities with our permission, highest good love and compassion can see us or access us or exist within this space. And we set the intention to see how our breath fuels the fire of our love and to allow us to grow those flames, to grow that fire, that passion each day. And my dragon guide is stepping forwards with a message at this time. In these flames, in this fire, see yourself, see your soul. Every cell, every atom, every fiber of your being is burning with this energy, just as the atoms vibrate with energy across this universe. This is the fire, this is the energy. And the source of this energy is love. The love that burns through all of us. Connected to, originating from, the source of love of this universe. The fire that rages in the centre of the galactic sun connects to every soul and to every living thing through space and time through the souls and cores of stars, through the souls and hearts of each of us. And this fire should be allowed to burn. We must permission our fire to burn. And so we set the intention to see in our sacral chakras 
this yearning, this hunger, this burning, this infinite resonance that fuels us, fuels our creativity, is the engine, the powerhouse of everything we do. Feel it. Feel it in you now. Feel how this fire is burning. See its flames and their different colors. Red and yellow and amber, like a new dawn of your creativity being born. Changing in color when you desire, like the violet flame to burn away negative energies. Or burning green into the heart energy, fueling your heart. There are so many colors to your fire. There is an entire rainbow burning within you. Allow this each day. Move your hips. Move your body. Dance. Even when you're doing the most mundane, boring human things, you may be doing your chores. You may be sat at a desk at work. You may be walking. You may have the opportunity to dance. Take the opportunity to move always and allow this sensual, sexual fire to burn within each of us. And with this raw energy, we bring forward this beautiful, beautiful light. We bring forward this fuel, fueled by the breath of us. For as we breathe in deeply each day, allow that energy to flow down through your lungs, through your heart, down into the fire of you, to your sacral chakra, to your roots, down into Mother Earth, into every aspect of you. And just as Mother Earth has the fires that rage beneath her surface, the lava, magma, that erupt into volcanoes, allow your energy each day through your creativity, through your sensuality, through your dance, through your singing, to burn and to feel that roar, to feel that fire. And as we practice together our dragon roars, we start releasing this energy with a sigh as an exhale. And we breathe in again through the nose. And this time we let out a tiny growl as we release. And breathe in through the nose. And now we prolong that growl as we release. Each time relaxing our vocal cords, breathe in through the nose. And this time push in your stomach, push in your diaphragm and tense your muscles as you release that energy. And now as we continue to allow this fire to burn and build up inside of us, we let our dragon roar out. Practice this throughout your day, building up. And when you feel the right energy that is right for you, then set the intention to release your energy and to burn the flames of your fire around you. You can bring in your dragon light language. And just as the dragon fire exists within us, it exists in everything in the planet, in our skies, in our stars. And so when you look to the clouds and you look to the stars, see the shapes, feel the energies, See the dragon's roar. See the dragon's shape. We share this gift, this knowledge, this ancient wisdom of dragon fire 
so that you can find your fire once more and lead by example to allow others to find theirs. We wish you the best of luck and the best of intentions practicing your dragon roars each day. We leave this protection and healing in place as we bring this meditation to an end, thanking our guides, our higher selves, Source, Gaia, Archangel Michael, Archangel Raphael, my dragon guide, and every soul that has assisted in this session. And so it is.